Okay, question 7. Calculate 507, subtract 291. If you get a question like this, it's like you've hit the jackpot because by now you should be knowing your column methods. So make sure you set it out with all the columns, with all the numbers lined up in the correct columns. So we've got 507, subtract 291. They will deliberately set the question out side by side to test whether or not you can set it out with one number on top of the other. So here we go. 7 take away 1 is 6, nice and easy. 0 take away 9, you can't actually do that. So you need to borrow one from the next column. So borrow 1, that becomes a 4. And the one that I've borrowed turns that into 10. 10 take away 9 is 1. And 4 take away 2 is 2. So your final answer is 216. So that's what needs to get written in the answer box.